All right, hello you guys, what is up? Welcome to the new year, it's 2023. This is the first vlog of this new year and I'm really excited. I hope you guys had a wonderful holiday. I miss you guys a lot, I feel like I haven't talked to you in forever. 2023 is gonna be such a big year, it's crazy. There's gonna be so many different things happening, like me matching, hopefully, <laughs> graduating, moving for residency, um, starting residency and intern year, crazy. Um, and then, you know, once, once I graduate, I actually want to go on a trip to Germany and Switzerland. I mentioned on Instagram that I wanted to go to Germany and a lot of you guys reached out and were like, oh my God, like come to Germany. So I know a lot of you live in Germany. And so if you have any recommendations or anything like that, please let me know. Um, I'm going to start planning that trip um, soon here and I need to get my passport and all of that. I'm just so excited. I'm definitely not the type of person who needs a new year to make big changes in their life. Like if something, if you want to change something about yourself or how you do things, then I think that just do it. Like it doesn't matter what time of year, but it's always nice to have a new year and then recenter and reestablish your values and, and reflect on who you are as a person and the intentions that you want to set for the new year. And um, it does feel like a new beginning. So that's it. That's our little huddle for the start of this vlog. I need to go to the gym. I need to go grocery shopping, but I also need to film a YouTube video. And then I also just want to kick back and watch YouTube or watch movies today. Um, I've got the house to myself and I am just totally ready to just sink in my bed and relax because my social battery has been completely drained from the holidays. I, I like holidays and I like spending time with family and friends and people that I love. There's just so much socializing that it is definitely draining and I definitely like to just be with myself and have me time and just recharge and reset. So yes, that's what I'm gonna be doing today. Let's kick back and relax on this gloomy day. Um. It's supposed to maybe rain today, which I'm really happy about. Have you guys heard of the wizard Liz? She's on YouTube. Her? I don't know what it is about her, but I really like her videos. She sets up her phone or her MacBook or something and just talks and gives like advice. And it's kind of like your closest friend giving you advice. And I don't know, the way that she executes her videos, it's so simple, but she gets so many views and she, I don't know, I really like the things that she has to say. Other people I also really like watching are Maggie McDonald um, and Emma, the two sisters. Um, and then I love Emma Chamberlain. <laughs> and uh, uh, those are like the main people I feel like I watch. I watch a lot of people, but um, those are my my faves. All right, you guys, I've been such a lazy gal, but I wanted to introduce our sponsor of today's video, which is Care Of. If you guys didn't know, Care Of is a subscription service that ships high quality personalized vitamins, supplements, and powders to your door every single month. All you do is take a quick quiz online and it asks you about your diet, lifestyle, um, and your health goals. And then they recommend vitamins and supplements based on your specific needs and goals. Um, this year, I definitely wanna work on maintaining a routine. I feel like I've kind of lost my day-to-day -day routine just because fourth year has been so chill but I really want to get on top of it again because going into residency I'm gonna have that structure and I rather just like start it ahead of time than have to do like a shock change in schedule and so taking my daily vitamin packs uh, from care of have been a really nice way to start my day on top of my morning coffee and just help me maintain that consistency day to day um, in my vitamin packs this one I have in particular has like a multivitamin in here and vitamin d3 um, and so I really like the multivitamin just because it helps uh, fill in the gaps of my day-to-day -day diet and then the d3 is actually um, something that we normally get if you like go out into the sun and stuff like that but I actually don't go outside that much um, it's nice to have this on board these are super cute because they're actually personalized they say your name on them and they say like a quote or like a challenge or fact on the little packets and these are actually made from a plant-based film um, so it makes it compostable which is really nice and then on top of my daily vitamin packets I have these digestive enzymes and I really like to take these when I'm eating um, stuff like dairy and stuff that I have like a harder time digesting because these help me out with that. So take care of Squiz and see what kind of vitamins and supplements they recommend for you. Click the link that I have down below and use my code Rachel Southern for 50% off your first order. That's about it. Um, yeah. What is this yellow stuff that I have on my bed? Do you guys see this? What is this yellow stuff on my bed? I don't know if it's from my lotion or my fake tan. Do you see that? It smells like my lotion. Oh man, I'm gonna wash my sheets now. Dang it. Yeah. 
You guys, look at what I got for Christmas. How cute is that? It was so crazy to open this and see like Dr. Southerd. Obviously, I'm not a doctor yet and I'm not going to use this until I graduate, but this is nuts. It was so crazy. But how cute is that? Dr. Southerd at your cervix. So cute. I love it so much. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited to use this. Woohoo. I just finished filming a video. It was the how I got into medical school video. It will have been out by the time you're watching this video. So go watch it if you haven't already. Just grabbing all my goodies because I was parked over here to film that video. I still need to go to the gym. I need to go grocery shopping. I need to finish drying these sheets because I had to turn this off because it was so stinking loud while I was trying to film. I need to wash off the makeup that I put on, like the little bit that I put on for that video. Some of you guys have been asking for like an updated um, skincare routine because you've been liking my skin. I've been liking my skin too. I think it has to do everything with like my vitamin regimen, drinking a lot of water, having collagen, all of that stuff. Um, but if you're interested in the things I've been using on my face, um, I will share them with you. Lately, I have been using this cleanser and I freaking love it so much. Um, this is like the best cleanser I've ever used. Occasionally, I will use this micellar water to get off any excess makeup, but this does a good job of actually getting it off. Um, I've been using a Charlotte Tilbury, the, the popular Charlotte's Magic Cream Moisturizer. I've been freaking loving this so much. Um, and then, uh, I don't know, my sister got this cleansing balm for me and for Christmas <laughs> and I've been using it and I really like it. To be honest, you guys, like, I wish that I had like a secret to my skincare, but I'll be real honest with you. It comes down to, I think, my genetics being hydrated, um, and like diet and stuff like that and like what you put in your body it shows up on your face. Um, so I wish I could like give you guys my secrets, but I don't really have any. I just wash my face twice a day. I don't sleep with makeup on. I also don't wear a lot of makeup. Um, but like, trust me, my skin has bad days. Like I have, I'll get pimples um, and stuff like that. But um, for the most part, my skin is pretty tame. Um, and I, I, I don't really know why. I know that's not the best answer that you guys were looking for. But that's all I got for you, I'm sorry. I went to the gym. No, I did not film anything in there because there's so many people. It seems like everyone's starting their New Year's resolutions now. Let's go to Trader Joe's. They don't have like anything here. It's like all wiped from Christmas, I guess. There's no less, like, anything. Um, oh, we have some smaller ones, too. Oh, that, that's not good. Yeah. Oh. There's a ginger, the white. You too. All right, I'm gonna make a little protein shake to hold me over before dinner, later. I've been using the Care Of Plant Protein in chocolate. You guys, this stuff, it tastes like a chocolate shake. It's so stinking good. It's so good, like, oh my God, I'm like out, I need more. Yay, I'm so happy I made dinner. Mmm, I got this recipe for my friend and oh my God, it's so good. It's so stinking good. Stunning, man, look at that. Mm. Good morning, guys. Um. I don't know if you can notice how swollen my eyes are. I think I was crying in my sleep. Let me know if that happens to any of you because it happens to me. Sometimes I'll wake up in the middle of the night mid cry during my dream or nightmare, whatever it is. And last night I did not. And uh, my eyes are swollen now. So 
I'm fine, I guess. I don't, I don't really know. This is a lot tastier than it looks, I promise. It's a tamale with um, a fried egg on top, but I fried the egg with red chili flakes or whatever, and then I have a bunch of tapatio. And it is finally coming to an end. All I'm saying, you guys, is that you better watch this video if you haven't already. It already is out by the time you're watching this vlog. It took me probably like five hours in total to edit a 20 minute sit down video. Please watch it. I spent so much time on it. Please watch it. I know you're gonna like it, okay? It's just kind of inspirational, if anything, okay? Because I have like nice little quotes in there. Just go watch it, okay? It'll be linked up here and down below in the description box. And this is so dirty. You guys are filthy animals in this lens, holy smoke. So excited, I'm on my way to grab a really exciting package. It's from Lynette, hey Lynette, if you're watching, which I know you are because you're so freaking awesome. She reached out to me because she was like, oh, I bought you a gift for graduation. It's ob -GYN related, I think, and so um, I'm really excited. I don't wanna wait till graduation to open it, so I'm probably gonna open it today in this vlog. <laughs> um, I'm so excited, but yeah, I'm really excited. So thanks, Lynette. You guys don't have to give me anything ever. Ever, ever, I don't expect you to get me anything. Like, please don't save your money and all that, but it was just really sweet of her, so I'm so excited. Oh my gosh. Yay, Lynette. Thank you, I got the package. Okay, I'm back home. I'm gonna open my gift from Lynette. I'm so excited. Okay. Oh my God, oh my God you're kidding, this is so cute. Definitely supposed to wait. Oh, look at the card. But I'm not gonna wait. I want to open this now. Oh my god! <laughs> Look at that, you guys. How cute! Oh my god, this is so stinking cute. I love this so much. Oh my god, my whole heart. Like this is so cute. Thank you, Lynette. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what to say. I'm like speechless. That is so thoughtful. Thank you so much, and all the kind words you said in your card oh my gosh my whole heart is literally exploding right now i'm gonna go call my mom and tell her all about this because it's so stinking cute <laughs> thank you i'm getting ready to go out to dinner i'm so excited um i was just curling my hair but check it out what i did um on christmas i burnt my neck pretty bad Eesh. pretty gnarly so just wanted to show you that. I got a comment on a recent video um, from Andy, if you guys know NDMD on YouTube. Um, he is a good friend of mine. He commented on my last video, or a few vlogs ago, and was like, is this what fourth year is like? And yes, it it is, honestly. Like after you do your auditions or you submit and you submit like all your residency applications and do most of your interviews, if not all, then like you kind of just get to coast and chill, which is so nice. And to be honest, like when I started filming or vlog like vlogging, I guess, for <laughs> on this channel, I had no clue like that this was in store for me. I thought med school was like nonstop studying, but honestly, after third year, it gets so much better. As you can see, like I'm not sitting in, at my desk the entire vlog like I used to be. Did not know uh, what it was like being a med student in first year, second year, third year, now fourth year. And so it's cool to be able to show you guys like although times are changing for me obviously and I'm not sitting at my desk all day like I used to putting in like 14 hours a day. It's it's cool to like still show you. I know that I would like appreciate seeing all this content to know what to expect I guess later on. I am excited to show you uh, next year when I go into residency because that's gonna be a challenge like showing you um, and trying to keep up with things just because I know that my time will be so limited and I know like there's not a lot of youtubers that kept up with YouTube during residency and I, I want to be as consistent as possible or at least give you like a sit down a weekly sit down or every two weeks sit down of what like my days have been like so I can stay in touch with you guys but I don't know we'll see you when we get there but anywho I'm gonna go out to dinner this uh, sweater is from Abercrombie my leggings are from Fabletics. This is what I'm wearing, guys. The Sapatos and the coat this is like my favorite coat of all time. Yes. That's it. Now we go.
I've been thinking about my resolutions for 2023 and other than getting back into a routine and maintaining one, I also am thinking about the learning curve that I'm going to have come July and I want to make sure that I give myself grace for that period of time and beyond. Just remind myself that it's okay to not know everything and it's okay to experience a sharp learning curve and it's all of part of growth. And another resolution that I have is to work on saving money a little bit better. I feel like I'm not that good at it. On top of maintaining good health, and overall wellness and making sure that I'm giving enough time for myself in the day no matter how little. With that being said, make sure you check out Care Of down below. I have all the details in the description box and until next time, take care of yourselves, be kind to yourselves, continue to work hard and all the good stuff. All right, I'll talk to you guys in the next video.